I'm gonna hit, am I just gonna hit DuPont or what? Um, oh, yeah, go up Ossington, sorry, right here. Yeah. Yeah, take it. Oh, my bad, vlog life, yeah. bro. Watch the, nope, okay. <laughs> Think about what people did back in the day when they didn't have access to GPS, they didn't have access to smartphones. How did people ever get around? Like, I don't understand. We were so dependent on these things for almost everything. They're literally an extension of ourselves. We can literally be lost in life without a smartphone. Like, how crazy is that for a second? Think about it. Huh? Oh, sorry, I missed that. I was on my phone. <laughs> Someone is watching this right now on their phone. Like, you're able to showcase your life as a result of smartphones. I just feel like we're all enslaved. We're just slaves to ourselves and to technology. And if the internet ever crashes, then a lot of people will just lose their identities. It's kind of sad, right? Yeah. Hey, you good, bro? I think so. No, I think I, I think I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> Downtown at the harbor front with Paris. I don't know how much fun we can have out here during the winter, but we'll see. How are we going to? Should we? We just snuck onto this boat illegally. <laughs> I mean, YOLO as the kids would say. Yeah. To be honest, I'm satisfying my need to be a pirate. It says security camera on board, so they're watching us. They're watching us, but I mean, whatever. Just left the abandoned pirate ship and found an ice skating rink. So much fun. I love doing random fitness stuff outdoors. I'm Paris Stu. They call me P2. I'm always doing something adventurous and random. <laughs> but that's how I came to start doing what I'm doing. So I'm a nutritionist and personal trainer. Help people embrace being strong in mind and body. If you're biking, it's important to have um, some good food with you all the time. That's efficient. Granola bars are actually a great idea. Always make sure you have your water. Keep hydrating. As even one or two percent of dehydration really affects your performance. But you really want to focus on posterior chain. So that's everything from your, you know, your mid-back, your lower back, your glutes, your hamstrings. The stronger you are, in body and mind, everything just becomes more pleasant, more enjoyable. Let's see if I end up going forward and backwards like 15 times. This is not working out. We're gonna have to go forward. No. It's a lot bigger than it looks. I mean, that's what she said. <laughs> Sorry, what? Curve. That's fine. Really far from the touch charger. I'll, I'll tell you when. Yeah, you're pretty good. Fuck yeah! Woo! So I figured. I'll just do like multiple things simultaneously and then I was talking to Joel last week and I'm like, hey, I might as well come and we'll do a vlog. Vlog life. Vlog life. <laughs> no, don't film this. If what had sex with what kind of crumpet? <laughs> the pancake had yeah. sex with the crumpet. Yeah. And were to spawn a child that was platter size. Yes! This is what it would be. It's just okay. like... <laughs> Fuck off. I've never heard anyone refer to it as a crumpet. I just call it a giant. Because it's got the cake. holes in it like a crumpet. It's true. No, it's okay. I'm joking. 
I don't know how to do it properly. Can you show me how to do it properly? Yeah. No, don't <laughs> film it. Do it properly. Honey, this is vlog life. Vlog life. There's always a camera around vlog life. You just have to don't play it. Can just roll out with it. Leaving nice there. Try the portion there, right there. Now what? Roll it out. Okay, why was I on my? F and then you roll and you pull yourself up back. Well, that sounds dangerous indeed. Yeah. Pull it. Stay on your knees. Yeah. There you go. Week four of the vlog. Me and Brad are planning to go to Los Angeles, California in the next month or so. Scott wasn't here this week. Scott, you're a bum. <laughs> I'm not sure if Hassan's in this in this episode, but I know he's shooting a film. He's shooting. Thanks for watching so far. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you know what's good for your life, you'll definitely subscribe. And watch every week because we will be uploading every week no matter what. Just got to Peter's brand new rental units. Follow me to the terrace. This is what dollars a month gets you. Yo, Glenn, what's your favorite Matrix movie again? Reloaded. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Because when I was young, I didn't realize how good this movie was from a psychological perspective. The second one is cool because you get to see all the training in action. I still really like the second one a lot though because there's a lot of really cool fight scenes. And they have to do with viruses and him like actually flexing his power, <coughs> his Neo. This is 12 year old Glenn talking. <laughs> all I'm offering is the truth, nothing more. This is my new rental unit. I own a digital marketing agency in the Junction. Investments in, in restaurants and clubs. Real estate's going pretty well. I'm hoping to hit the market next year, 2018, when it gets warmer and just like blow this up. It's been crazy because we both have completely different businesses, but yeah, we both do the, uh, the real estate investment on the rentals, which is helping us quite a bit. Uh, it's been a very interesting, interesting journey, interesting time. At home, editing and about to upload week four before I head out again to start filming for week five. This is the longest episode we've had thus far. Hopefully you still watch the entire thing regardless. Shout out to everyone that's been commenting and liking on the videos so far. Hopefully you do the same for this one, especially considering I broke into a abandoned pirate ship and I might get arrested for it. Anyway, I'll see you week I was five. Busy getting racks when that thing tried to come back, told a bitch I'm cool and I choose.